Howdy Beast Nation, General Driggers here once again talking about beast mentality. In the previous video, I spoke about collusions and conflict. And fundamental to those dynamics and fundamental to resolving those situations is a sober awareness of your impact on others. Now, some leadership authors have actually referred to this idea as the wake that leaders leave behind them, kind of like the wake behind a boat. Some leaders leave behind them a wake that's empowering, trust building, inspiring. These leaders invest in their people. They see their people, they care for their people, and they set a compelling vision that the team can get after. I spoke about that in a previous video, and we all have had supervisors that have really left that positive wake behind them. Others, unfortunately, leave behind the wake that's disempowering, trust destroying, and exhausting. And as I mentioned in previous videos, sometimes those leaders may be blind to the very wake they leave behind them. With an outward mindset, though, we ought to be squarely interested in understanding the wake we leave behind us. We want to know the impact we have on others. One of the simple but highly effective tools to get after this is called the three questions. The first question, how does somebody in my role affect or potentially affect your ability to do your work, both positively and negatively? The second, how could a person in my role be most helpful to you? And the third, how often can I check in with you on how well these changes are working? I've used the three questions uh, many times before with folks that uh, work for me and folks that I work with and folks that I work for. And you know, I've been amazed every time about how effective those three questions can be. Now critically, you've gotta to listen to the answer to the first question. Often whenever I've asked the three questions, I've been surprised at what I've heard. Like I mentioned previously, when we're inward, we're blind to what the other person actually needs or wants. So when you stay inward, and you start to take action on the way you think the other person is needing change, you're acting in a way that's self-deceived. But when you get outward and you ask the question and then really listen, you might learn something valuable in the relationship. Perhaps you may find that something that's a big deal to them might not actually mean the big change from your perspective, but it's something that'll have a real positive impact on the other. But when you ask that question, and you really consider how are some small changes that you can make going to make their job easier, then you can make the change, measure its impact, and then check in every once in a while to continue to make sure that your change is having the desired effect. So as leaders, I ask, please take an account for how you impact others. Your wake is important. It should be positive. Thanks, Beast Nation. Until next time, Dirk Driggers out.